Hello, I'm Jeremy Payne and welcome back to The Last Plague Blight, where of course in the last one we started to move into the mansion. Uh, we've still got the floors to sort out and I managed to sort those ridges out as well that we were having in between these. Uh, it's not it's actually pretty perfect. I was going to say it's not perfect, but it actually is. Uh, what I did was take the floors up and then just dig those ridges back out and then put the floors back down again. And that seemed to work well. And we had one over here as well. And that's pretty much worked. So, uh, yeah, if you have that problem, just take them out and um, put them back down. And it seems to work well. Uh, I've got a wagon full of stone and I've also got a load of stone on me as well because I want to start to make these floors so we can then move in. And actually sort of you know know the layout of the land as it were so uh, let's check oh, I've got a bunch of small stones on me so I'll try and build the walls today I'd quite like to get the floors and walls in uh, we did also go out to this uh, where is it uh, this iron deposit over here this rocky outcrop and there's no blight around that at all so we need to take the wagon back there load it down with as much iron as we can bring back and then start making some shields and that sort of thing as well. Uh, I might try and do that today. We'll see how it goes. Uh, but I really want to crack on with this. So it's going to be a lot of just cuts of me grabbing stone. Bringing it back. That sort of thing. So yeah, it's probably going to be a lot of cuts in this one. Uh, just because I want to get this done. So uh, let's get that in place. That's that one done. Let's go to this one next. Just t stacks of two as well. It's, uh, oh boy. Yeah. There's a lot to it, but let's put this one together. I think most of the walls are pretty much ready to go as well. So uh, we'll try and get those. we got a load of the quick climb mixed up, and then we'll start thinking about the next set of walls. Uh, like I say, I'm probably going to have little sort of fences here and here and kind of partition this place off. This front bit, I'm not sure. I may go half walls. I may just put full, full walls in. I haven't really decided yet. Uh, what we're going to do and then probably have a little area that juts out here with some fences around it or something uh, but again not totally decided on that one yet let's grab all of the rocks um, the quarry is starting to like over there I didn't go over there because there was a brown bear over there so uh, I left it and I went that way and found another quarry but yeah we're starting to strip those clean as well so uh, we're going to need to find some more quarries soon uh, but let's, I don't think we're going to quite get this one done are we Oh, one large rock off, damn it. <laughs> Wouldn't you believe it? Right, uh, that one. Stone wall. Ah, oh, I actually need to grab some small stones before I put those in there. That would help, wouldn't it? There we go. Let's grab that. So I've been grabbing small stones and the large stones, obviously, because um, we need these for the walls as well. So that's good. That's. That still needs more. Oh, man. It's mostly stone now, isn't it? But obviously we need some of these as well. Um, yeah, I think I've got some. Have I got some logs out there? No, I haven't got any logs out there. That's fine. Uh, so that's all done. We could start building some of this. I just need one large stone. Surely I can find one. Surely I can just find one large stone. That's all I need. Uh, chop down a tree here as well for some firewood. Uh, we'll kind of saw those up into play. Oh, great. It's bloody... Oh, boy. Yep. There's uh, bloody coyotes over there. I just need one large stone. Well, there'll definitely be one over here. Just to finish that floor off. That would be kind of nice. Small stones, of course. Ah, there's a large one. Yeah, we have this, but it is just completely caked in blight. So, um, yeah. I'd like to move that blight back. But there's not much I can do about it at the moment, so... Uh, you know, it is what it is. Um, and I guess we'll start chopping some trees down and sawing up some logs for some planks. I think that's really the next thing. And then we can actually arrange the workshop area a bit better than we've done once we get these uh, floors in. But I'd like to try and get all the floors in today if possible. But I don't know if that's going to be possible. But yeah, I managed to get rid of that ridge, so that worked. Um, that's pretty handy, actually. Uh, let's just speed that up a little bit. There we go. That's good. Uh, oh, auto save. And then, yeah, I've got this one. And then this is the ground that was left. So you possibly want to just lay your floors out before you build your building, maybe. And then take them up. Uh, level them off and then take them up. And, yeah, I think that might be a better way of doing it. I'm not too sure, to be honest. But, um, right, uh, where is my saw? I don't have it on me, do I? I think it's over here. 
Uh, we've still got some stuff like the workbench and things like that to take apart as well, uh, which we will do. But I'd like to just get the floors in and then we kind of roughly know where we stand then. Uh, oh, where is my saw? Is it in the backpack? Oh, where is it? Oh, there it is. We have to make a steel one of those as well, actually. That's something else we need to do, isn't it? Um, we've got like we've still got this bronze one. It's like the first tool you make, isn't it? And um, yeah, we should uh, we should change that up, I think, and uh, actually make a decent one. But obviously, we've got to go back out there and get that all uh, get that all mined up. So let's grab that and we'll chop this up now. There we go. It's all good. Take the twig, I guess. And we'll drop those down. I think I need, oh no, I need one more because I pulled one up, didn't I? So we do need some more soaring. There we go. And I think we'll cross over the river. I'm seeing a bear over that way. I think that's a black bear, though. Uh, let's put that floor back down there. We've got some planks on us. And then this one obviously needs, so I need three more here. And then I, that one's probably going to be stone as well uh, with the fire on it. Uh, that, was, that was kind of my thinking on that one, so... Let's go there, up to there, like so, there we go, that's good, and then we will put, oh, did you put all of those in there? Um, okay. Oh, I've got to level it, uh, of course, I was just thinking, why can't I, uh, why can't I put planks in there, because I've got to level it, that's why, so, uh, let's do that next. Get that all leveled, and then we'll drag the cart over to the other side, I think. There shouldn't be too much to level on this one. Yeah, you just have to do a little bit, but there's just a touch of that ground, I think, that I couldn't quite get level. But as I say, it's a lot better than it was. Those was kind of ridges, but yeah, just pulling that up seemed to fix it. Um, yeah, let's go over to the other side, and I need to start to make some... Well, I want to make, I was going to say... I need to start making some storage, but I'd quite like to make those. I don't think there's any reason to, but they might have bigger storage, is kind of my thinking. Um, yeah, it says it keeps wildlife out as well as the rain, but I'm, I'm kind of curious more on the storage size. If there's no storage size difference, then you might as well just make the wooden ones. Uh, but if they do allow you to store more items, then those ones might be better. So I wouldn't mind doing that as well. Um, I'm not too sure on what the time of day is. Uh, to be honest, I lost track when I was uh, collecting stuff. So, um, yeah, I think we'll just do some gathering. And then in the morning, we'll go out to that iron and try and start smithing some of that up then. Because I'd like to at least make one of those. And I say, I don't know if it gives you more storage space. If it doesn't, then it's you might as well just go with the wooden ones. They're a lot cheaper. Uh, I need to... There we go. I was going to say, I've kind of picked this place clean. There's obviously a decent amount there, but there's a lot of blight, so uh, there's not much I can really do about it. Oh, there's that. Yeah, there's the brown bear. He's over there. Okay, well, you stay over there, mate. Don't come this way. You stay... No. So don't come this way. Stay over there, because... Well, I don't really want to take him on, but I do need a shield if I'm going to take that guy on. Uh, oh, I brought some stuff that I shouldn't have done, but oh well, never mind. So I'm just going to start grabbing, and... Keeping an eye out for your friend over there. If he stays over there, but yeah, these uh, these quarries are slowly being depleted of resources. Um, and yeah, let's say the other one is covered with blight that's near the base. It's not very big, but it's covered in blight. So uh, we can't mine these rocks. It'd be kind of nice if we could mine some of these rocks as well. Like, you can mine the limestone. I guess we should do that at some point. Hmm. We're going to probably need more limestone mortar because uh, I'm undecided whether uh, whether we're going to use sticks for the fences on the outside. I'm kind of leaning towards that because I've got a lot of sticks and it would be a lot cheaper to do. Uh, but we'll see on that one. Uh, but anyway, I'm just going to grab up a load more stone. Hopefully we can get those walls finished because I think the small stones are pretty well much all that I'm missing from those. I've got the large stones in there and I'm just missing the small stones in them and all the limes in there, so yeah, if we can get those done, ah, we're full let's just run back then and we'll just keep gathering I think there's more yeah, well, this quarry's not going to last me too long, but still 
Right, anyway, let's say I'm just going to crack on and continue gathering. Okay, it's the morning, and I've got everything pretty much in a buildable state. Um, I think there might be a few things missing. Obviously, we've got to take the fire up and put a stone floor, I think, in there, uh, just to put the fire on. And then we could take down that smoker and move that over here as well. Um, so let's start building some of this stuff now. I think most of it is ready to go. So let's do that. I think I've got most of the wooden floors down, although I might be missing a few planks actually on that one. I'm not too sure what that one is looking like. Uh, oh no, that one's ready to go as well. Fair enough. I didn't think I've got planks in that one, but I have. Uh, this one... Oh, I've got to level the floor out. Okay. Alright, I'm just boiling some water up in there. Um, I've got like an hour and a half left, so I figured I might as well boil another pot of water. We've got plenty, but you know, might as well use up that uh, fire whilst it's going. So there we go, that's good. So that's all the floor pretty much in. We'll just let that finish boiling and then we can uh, take that up, set and lay out another floor and I've got a bunch of stone there. It's not gonna be quite enough, but it's gonna get us a good way there. So I think we'll start building these walls next as well. Let's start doing that, shall we? Let's start putting these walls together now and we'll start bringing this thing together. So let's do a load of that and then we can start ripping that down as well. Let's go there. There we are. Walls in. Yeah, there we are. That's good. Get that one. I think most of them, as I, I think they might be. Oh, hello. Enemies, where are they? Uh, oh, bloody hell, there's some wolves out there. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh, thankfully, they've wandered off because they don't give a crap about the fire either. So, yeah. It's only the coyotes that really care about the fire, so let's continue to put that together. Doesn't look like a particularly nice day so far, does it? Hopefully the sun comes out later, but um, yeah, right now it doesn't look great. So it is like my oh great, yeah. Look, there's bloody balls sticking their heads in. Oh, what's going on in here? Yeah. <laughs> oh god, I, I really need to get that shield as well. Uh, we may have to drag the cart over there, I think, and get that uh, iron on the go. Uh, I'd also like to put some storage in, and I'd like to build one of those... Um, oh, there we go, the sun's coming out. Uh, I'd like to build one of those um, uh, storage chests. Not sure what that's like. Not sure what they're going to be like, but um, if they don't store more materials, then I will just build the other ones. But um, if they do, then it's definitely going to be worth building those. So we can get more stuff in. So there we go, but they're going to be expensive. Oh man. Ooh. Oh, I need one stone, damn it. Bloody wolves are coming back this way as well. Go away. I don't have a shield to fight you, so I don't really want to fight you just yet. Oh boy, hang on, no. God damn it. It's like they know, isn't it? They're just there. <laughs> no, don't, don't walk into my, no, don't. Um, please don't walk into my can cart, please. Damn it. Chase that. Look, there's a r delicious rabbit over there. Go and chase it. Go chase. No, okay. All right, well, I can't really do any more, so I need a small stone. Well, let's run away. Uh, let's do the honorable thing and run away. <laughs> and hopefully we just find a small stone somewhere about the place. Um... Wow, this is really, yeah, this is really getting swamped as well, because I'm pretty sure I ran around here. Uh, that blight was like in the middle somewhere over there, but yeah, now it's really, yeah, they're just going in. Oh, what's going on here? It's a nice shelter. They all seem to really like that, that place. Ah, there we go. Perfect. Let's grab some more as well. May as well, let's go and grab some more. I might just run away. Hopefully they'll despawn. It's probably the best thing to do. Oh great, there's bloody coyotes over there as well. Might as well grab a few of these because we're going to need them. Yeah, I need I need to go and get that shield, I think. Or at least go and get the iron to make that shield. I could just make the standard one again, but I know I just I want to I want to build the reinforced one instead. Um yeah, this is where we picked all the uh, copper those many many moons ago now. Uh yeah, if we just run away a little way. Yeah, look at that. It's getting so swamped with blight, it's crazy. Uh, is that... Is that the same set of wolves? 
No, but there's more wolves over here. The oh boy. Okay, right. Oh, we're kind of, kind of in an animal sandwich. If they're just everywhere. <laughs> right. Hopefully those guys. Hopefully I've ran far enough away that they may have despawned. That's my hope, anyway. Uh, got enough stones just to finish that wall off, and then we can finish the other wall. And then I've got a few small, st uh, large stones as well. So hopefully we can just finish that. No, I'm just... Oh, no, it's a rabbit. Is that a rabbit? It's a rabbit, right? Yeah, it's a rabbit. I think they've gone. They've probably followed me. That's probably the same walls. So they to follow me over there a bit. So let's get that in there. Let's get that built as well. And we've got to throw some walls on the front of this place as well. Uh, it's not exactly going to stop them walking in, but it's better than nothing, so... Let's come over. I think this one might need... Oh, there we go. I'm glad I went out and got those stones then. <laughs> Alright, that's good. So, let's just peel that as well. So we've got all the walls in. We've got all the floors in now. Obviously, we've got to get the front walls in as well. Uh, this is died off. So, uh, let's drink as much of that as we can. And I'm just going to place that down. Uh, like over there for the moment. I'm pretty sure the water evaporates. And then we'll take apart that. And then we'll lay down a um, a stone floor here. Because I want the uh, I want the fire on a stone floor. Uh, it seems silly on wood. So um, let's put that there. Get that to there. Like so. There we go. That's good. And then I've got to level this sucker out, haven't I? Oh boy, that's the fun part. We've got to level this thing out. That takes a long time. Actually, it might not be quite so bad. It's reasonably level anyway. And then I'm going to have to get 30 some odd stones. I think that stacks about 24. So, yeah, we're not too far off there. And then I'm debating whether to go out. I might go and get that iron next. Because I, I do really want to build that, um, uh, that shield. Because I don't have what I need for that, do I? Uh, and then that's going to break as well, isn't it? One more swing of the hammer. And that is going to break. Yeah, no, I've only got like uh, eight pieces. And we need like 12, I think it was, for that. So, yeah, that's a shame. All right, well, we'll level this out. Actually, we could put some walls in as well, couldn't we? Hmm. Yeah, let's do some Let's do some walls and stuff. Uh, put the front ones in. So, I was kind of wondering whether to do just some sort of low walls here. Hmm. I like the kind of front of the property, as it were. I don't know. Let's have a let's have a look at that, shall we? Let's do their big walls on the back here. Hmm. Not too sure on that one. Kind of let that percolate for a bit. How much do we actually need of that? It's a lot less materials, isn't it? Well, it's half a wall, isn't it? So it's going to be a lot less materials. Does that? Yeah, hmm. not sure on that one. I'll have to let that percolate and then let's just level that out a little bit more. And then I was thinking of doing um, the stick fences in the middle here and here, just to kind of fence this off a little bit. And this is kind of an open walkway where we can drag the, uh, where we can come in and out. And it's kind of sectioned off with those stick fences. Um, and. I think we could use the mud then as well. Just to kind of change it up a little bit rather than just everything is stone. Uh, so, that's good. So I now need a bunch of these rocks. Uh, let's grab all of those. Start putting them in here. How many was that? 34. That's not too bad, actually. We could get that sorted. That's good. Sure, that's not bad. i got 20 in there already, plus there's one out there. That is not bad, I just need 13 more. That is not too difficult. And then, we'll go and do that in a minute. Let's just go and grab some sticks from here. And kind of show you what I was thinking. Uh, there we are. Like, so there. Like that. And then we could put the um, mud daub on it as well. We could daub it with that. So there. And then we can either do that one there. I'm thinking that way. Just kind of change it up a little bit. I've got loads of sticks as well. So um, it wouldn't be that difficult to do. And then I guess you could try and do sticks out here like that. 
Hmm. You could have, you could do sticks, or you could even do water, uh, stone walls. You could have a little covered piece out here. I was going to have it open, but maybe we could have it covered. Hmm. So apart from the firewood, though, I don't really mind what else is outside. It doesn't really matter, does it? So, hmm. Uh, but yeah, that's what I was thinking with this anyway. So we could just put a load of sticks in there and yeah, that would be uh, that would look quite good, I think. Um, but yeah, let's go and grab a bunch of stones. And then I think we might go out and try and get that iron next. Alright, here we are. I should have everything we need. So let's get that built. There we are. And then we can put that uh, back again. And then we can put the... Um, uh, put the smoker over the top of it. I'm not sure if we really need the smoker, to be honest, but we'll do it anyway. Uh, oh. Must be placed on the terrain. Oh, can I not place this on a stone floor? Huh. Yeah, we did have that problem last time, didn't we? So, maybe I just built that for nothing. We could just have that as nothing. I guess it works. Well, we could put it there. It doesn't really work there, though, does it? But I guess I could put it there. Yeah, I don't really like that. No, no, no. It's on the wood. I'm going to pull that up, I think. I think we'll take this back up again. Yeah, I kind of ran out there for nothing then. Yeah, it's kind of odd. You can't. You can kind of place it in between um, where, obviously, it thinks there's a little bit of terrain still showing. But, yeah, you can't actually place it on there. So... All right, well, that's fine. Let's pull this up then, and we'll just have that bear. It's a little unfortunate, but yeah, we'll go with it. It's fine. Um, we kind of cleared the ground out, so it looks a little better. Ooh, okay. That's, yeah, not what I, quite what I wanted to do, but there we go. <laughs> so, all right, I just went and collected all that stuff for nothing. So, well, I might as well, no, not for nothing, I might as well put this stuff in here for now. Oh, I need to put one in there. I could break these up as well for some small stones. Uh, but I'm probably going to put some more stone outside. So, uh, like, I might put a stone out there or something like that. So, uh, for now, though, we could just store those in there. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm kind of leaning towards the half walls just to kind of change it up a little bit. Give it a bit more definition than that. But, I don't know. What do you guys think? Half walls or the full walls out here? This is kind of like the front of the building. I was kind of thinking half walls. Um, but yeah, let's get this moved out of the way. Oh boy. Alright, well, we've got we got a load of stone. I was going to say that's a waste of time, but it does mean as well we kind of you kind of clear out the area, which I quite like the, the look of it once you've done that levelling process. Um, kind of uh, clears it out. I quite like it. Alright, let's do that. It should be enough just to get that going, and then we'll get that fire in there put the smoker in and then I'm going to go over to where the iron is and start collecting that so yeah so we'll put that back there I'm going to put it we probably want it close to our that's probably where our sleeping bag is roughly going to be I might move the sleeping bag um, yeah let's put that there let's build that I may take this floor up eventually and try and dig out that bush um, just dig out some of these little bits that we've got sticking out maybe uh, I'm not too sure on that one, we'll see oh, hello, we've got a uh, there we go, let's put that in there, like so that's good, let's go and just chuck the rest of this in here ah, it's only 20 isn't it, yeah yeah, let's say the stone stockpiles I am not bothered about those being outside I'm absolutely fine with that but uh, I really don't want these uh don't want the firewood to be outside. So we could take that down and put the smoker in there and just make sure we can get that in there. We should be able to, but uh, we'll just make sure. Oh, hang on. No, no. I'll take the smoke fire rack apart. Well, I mean, I might as well take the fire pit apart as well because um, I can get the stone out of it and put it in the walls. It's a good idea. Well, that's where the original pit was, so there we are. That's all good. Brilliant. Right, let's come back over here. I was going to run through the walls then, but I can't. <laughs> no such luck now. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of leaning towards these half walls. Kind of leaning towards those. It's so much cheaper on the stone as well, isn't it? It'd be so much easier to do. 
Yeah. Uh, what about do these need long sticks? I think they do, right? Yeah, they do. Oh no, duh! I don't want to. I don't want to put the long sticks in there. I need to. Uh, what am I doing? I need to make the smoker. There we go. Right there we are. Let's build that. We may adjust the position of this this stuff later on once we've uh, gotten used to the build and think oh, actually that's in the wrong spot. It just needs to move over slightly, but I think for now that's okay. That's all good. Right, I'm gonna. Yeah, I've got a load of stone. Let's just store the little stones in there for the moment. I've got a bunch in my hand. Uh, we've got the nails, so that's good. Uh, so we just need to go over there and get the iron. I would like to do that and build those chests and build that. Um, oh, I've got no space in there. All right, let's put that in there. Oh, we could get that in there as well. That's good. And then we could build those chests and we could also try and build that um, uh, shield as well. I'd quite like to do that. Okay, well I've made it here. I've harvested the first rock. This blight looks like it's got a little bit closer than before. Or is it just me? Uh, let's keep on going though. Uh, it wasn't too bad to get over here, but uh, there's a lot of blight that you've got to negotiate. And sometimes you've got to take a really wide berth because there's trees and stuff in the way. And the, the cart's a bit difficult to drag through those sorts of things. So um, yeah, we're basically going to load everything up. I could take the, small, the stones back, but they're close to base. So I just want to take iron and nothing else um, that's all we're taking back we're going to load this cart up and probably fill it and I think that's probably going to take most of the day to be perfectly honest uh, we'll see how much although my pickaxe may not last we'll see how long that actually lasts uh, but yeah there's quite a lot of iron nodes to mine up so we'll just get as much of them as we can until either that's full or the pickaxe breaks I'm not too sure which one uh, we could probably be done with some of that stuff. Oh, great. There's a bloody wolf. Bugger off. Go away. Oh, God. The wildlife as well keeps getting in the way. It's the same with the other place as well, wasn't it? Whenever I tried to mine anything, they just seem to turn up and go, oh, what's going on over here? <laughs> All right. Well, I'm just going to have to get my stamina back. Hopefully, I don't get ripped to pieces by a wolf. And, uh, yeah, we just got to load that thing up. Okay, right, that has probably taken me most of the day. I'm starting to run low on food and my water is out as well. Uh, but I've got basically all of the iron. There's a few little blobs here that I've left behind because I'd be a little bit weighed down. Uh, but yeah, other than that, I've ironed, mined out all of that stone. So we need to get back. The cart is completely full of iron. So that should last us for a hell of a long time. Though It depends what those... Um, chests are like this is probably a bit overkill but they could be really good or they could be not quite so good so uh, it just depends really doesn't it if they store a lot of uh, materials then they're going to be amazing if they don't then um, yeah this was a bit of a bust but still either way we've got plenty of iron so we're not going to have to come back here anytime soon so I am going to make my way back now and yeah I'll see you guys it's probably going to be in the morning damn this is going to take a long time it's taken me all day to do this actually so uh, yeah uh, I'm just going to see you guys back at the base I guess and we'll do a little bit of smithing to round out the seri uh, episode series episode there we go okay it's the morning I managed to make it back it took some time it's more that you just have to navigate the terrain and then obviously there's animals and the blight and stuff in the way that uh, this thing uh, takes a bit of time uh, it doesn't do well in tall grass and any sort of like sort of muddy areas uh, avoid them with this uh, mostly it's just this grass really is probably the best way to go it actually goes really well over the quarry as well um, it, I would assume it probably thinks it's a road or something but um, it goes quite nicely over the quarry uh, but we managed to get a ton of iron and I've got 80 there and then I cooked up about 30 I think it was something like that in here uh, I moved the steel anvil in and we'll probably use that eventually we'll just turn that into nails um, it's almost it's on its last legs one more go and it's down but for now let's not worry too much about that uh, let's put that in there as well actually and we'll just get that heated up and then we'll st we'll make this chest i want to try that first i'm curious to know whether it has more storage i'm not sure that it does but if it does it would be really really handy but uh we can't forge that Oh, duh, I'm doing the wrong thing. What am I doing? I'm doing... <laughs> i got to do the blooms first before I can do the raw tire. There we go. I'm jumping ahead of things here. Uh, let's do a couple... Oh, let's do a couple of those as well. So we do need to make one of those. That's good. Um, I think I need like 12 of those. And it takes two 
of uh, these to be able to do that. So uh, two wrought iron to make one of those, um, one of these things. So yeah, let's go though. There we are. That's good. We'll just keep on doing this. Add that in there. We'll throw that in there as well. It's good. So I've made one. So I'm going to need 22, I think it is, in total. So that's going to be quite a bit of smithing. There we are. Let's get this on the go. We'll just put that in there. That's all good. Uh, but yeah, it took a little bit of time to get back. But as I say, you're just going to kind of navigate the terrain with this, the cart. It's just the way it is. Uh, let's try and do another one at least get a little bit done whilst we uh, got a little bit of heat left uh, it might have gone overboard with this iron but if nothing else at least we've uh, got it uh, we, we won't need to go back there for a very long time um, we'll see what this chest is like I'm kind of curious on that because obviously we know what the shield is going to be like it's going to be just a better version isn't it whereas I'm kind of curious to know what this um, chest is like I think it's going to uh, Oh, God. Uh, would you guys just leave me alone? I'm trying to forge. Daddy. <sighs> I mean, I'm safe in here, but obviously they could come round and... Yeah, damn it. Bloody wildlife. Go away. Go away, wildlife. Right, I'm going to have to uh, dump, dump the slag in here for the moment. There we go. Where I've just been dumping it. I'll take it somewhere and dump it later, but. Oh, for. <sighs> okay, alright. I'm going to have to run away and I hope we'll come back. Hopefully they'll despawn. I'm just going to run them off and. Yeah, hopefully they despawn and we can carry on with that. Okay, there's the last one. It's started to rain, of course. So let's get that all heated up. Uh, I just ran back and they, yeah, they've despawned, so that's good. Uh, we'll try and make another. Actually, I've got an extra one, really, but never mind. I don't need to do quite so many. Uh, but there we go. Let's make as many of those. I just used the anvil the bronze one as well, and that's broken. Uh, like I say, we'll just pick that up, though, and we'll just make nails and stuff out of it. That's fine. We do need to make a load of storage chests and tables and all that sort of thing anyway. So uh, that's good. Uh, let's just keep cooking this up. I'm running out of twigs, actually. Uh, oh, I need to actually put that in there to heat it up, don't I? There we go. Let's throw another one in there as well. We could actually just leave half of them in there. That's a good point. I should have done that. Uh, so what are we? Halfway there. That's good. I've got some planks and I've already got some nails. So we should, shouldn't be too difficult to be able to do this. So let's just get that all knocked out. There we go. That's good. Brilliant, and then we'll just ignite that again. Run out of twigs, but no bother. That's fine. It did rain last night as well, actually. So, um, yeah, we need to get those rain catchers down. Or I'd quite like to. We don't necessarily need them, but I quite like those rain catchers. Uh, so I just need one more piece. And then that should be enough to then forge that. So now I've got the 12 pieces. So, is this thing any bigger? Let's have a look. I mean, as I say, I don't think it's going to store anything. It just says it protects from rain and hungry wildlife, whereas the other one just protects from rain. So, I'm wondering if there's going to be a mechanic where the wildlife comes in, like if you've got food or something in there, they come in and attack it, maybe. Uh, maybe there's something like that. But I'm not sure where the front of this thing is. I think it's there. Let's put it down anyway. You can always take it up if we... Uh, if it doesn't work too well. So I've got some nails in here. And then I've got some more back at the old base. And then some planks are over here. Should be enough. There we go. And then let's put that there. I think we'll just put that there. And then we can store uh, like charcoal and stuff like that in there. Uh, which, as I say, we do need to do another charcoal burn. But not right now. Well, I guess we could do. Uh, where is the... Well, I think they're in the old backpack, right? Yeah, that's, everything's getting soaked in there. Yeah, so it does protect from the rain, though, doesn't it? So I guess that's something. Right, and then we'll see. Uh, so I think there was a dozen spots in there just. So uh, let's see. I've got wet nails. I don't suppose that matters. Let's knock this thing together now. 
using our new hammer. We've burnt through burnt through 25% of that already. Bloody hell. Okay, alright, well, there we go. So, alright, we've built this thing. It looks pretty cool. I quite like the look of it, but yeah. Okay, so no, there's no point building those yet. Um, I'm assuming that there'll be a, I say, the animals will raid your stuff or something maybe. I'm not sure. Um, they do look better, but yeah, I've got slightly more health. It's got like 500 opposed to 300, but the storage is basically the same. Oh, it's stopped raining as well. So um, I wouldn't say that was a wasted journey because now we've got all the iron we're probably ever going to need. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just going to build the regular ones. It's just it's just six planks of wood and some nails as opposed to 12 of those. Uh, we could even take this thing apart and make the shield with them. We could do that at some point. Uh, but anyway, I think for now, I think this is where we'll call it and we'll end the episode. And we'll start getting some more of that storage down in the next one. Um, and then we might go to the swamp and try and put some, uh, try and pick some slime up. But there is the rest of the base to take down and like the uh, workbench and things to move over. And also start making like the, uh, uh, was it, the utility tables and all this sort of thing. So, and I'd like to make some rain catchers as well, just to have them grindstone to come in here so yeah there's still quite a bit to do uh, but anyway i think for now this is where i'm going to call it and i'll end the episode so if you like that one please give me a thumbs up comment your thoughts down below subscribe for more i really do appreciate it stay safe out there everyone and i'll catch you next time